Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to 10 Central Pointers. Before we start, I just want to remind you to hit that red subscribe button so you never miss any of our videos in the future. You know when you see photos of fuzzy kittens looking so soft and cuddly that you just want to reach out and snuggle them? Well, there's fluffy cat breeds that stay that way into adulthood. Fluffy cats require regular maintenance, as Kendra Martin, owner of Bed and Biscuit Pet Grooming in Kingsington, Illinois, explains. The single most important thing a pet owner can do is brush their cat daily. Today's video is going to be about the seven fluffiest cat breeds. Number one, Maine Coons. Maine Coons are the official cat of the state of Maine and have been dubbed the gentle giant of the domesticated cat world. These cats love all attention and always want to be with you. Maine Coons are robust cats and are regal in appearance. They have coats that vary in length and usually have long, bushy tails. Their coats are also silky and somewhat oily, but they require some brushing to maintain their coats. But because Maine Coons are so social, they usually enjoy being groomed. Number two, Norwegian Forest Cats. The Norwegian Forest Cat is moderately active and super smart. Overall, they make great companions. They have a waterproof insulated double coat that was designed to withstand Scandinavian winters. Norwegian Forest Cats have long fluffy coats and surprisingly, they don't require much maintenance as some other long haired cats do. Number three, Persians. Persians are known for their long flowing coats and sweet personalities. The Persian was the number one breed named by the Cat Fancy Association for more than 30 years and was just unseated in 2014 by the exotic. In 2014, the Persian took the number two spot for most popular cat. Keep Persians indoors and protected from the elements. Their coats need constant grooming and attention. Persians require a lot of maintenance. Number four, Ragdolls. The Ragdoll is a real people lover. They are very loyal, often with seemingly dog-like behavior. They are known for greeting their owners at the door and following them around wherever they go. Ragdolls have semi-long coats that require some brushing with a steel comb to keep them looking their best. Number five, Siberians. The Siberian is a durable cat that is both courageous and laid back. Their beautiful coats repel water, have a beautiful ring of fur around the neck, full fluffy legs, and a bright bushy tail. They require moderate brushing and usually remain tangle free. They're hardy cats, as one might imagine having originated in Russia and coming to the United States after the Cold War ended in June 1990. Many believe that the Siberian is a hypnoallergenic cat, although this has not been proven scientifically. Number six, Burman. The Burman is similar to the Siamese of Thailand, but he has a stockier body white feet and a long silken coat that comes in all pointed colors, including chocolate and lilac. He's considered a medium to large size cat weighing between seven and 12 pounds. The Berman is a calm, affectionate feline who enjoys spending time with its family, especially if you give it lots of attention. Bermans get along well with children and other pets. If you talk to him, your Berman will respond in a soft, pretty voice, but he's not as vocal as a Thai Siamese. Although Bermans are less active than some breeds, they have a serious, playful side. 7. Somali Cat The Somali is moderate looking in all aspects with smooth planes on her head. She has a gentle dip in the triangular head. Her rather large ears sit tilted forward, giving her an alert, aware look, as if she is always paying attention to everything. The eyes, which look large in the face, show the alertness and intelligence inherited in the breed. The coat of the Somali is full with exaggerated tufts of hair in the ears. The fur is soft, without being woolly, and the tail is fluffy like a fox's tail. The coloring of the Somali is special. The majority of the fur has bands of color in each individual hair, with the coat looking darker along the spine line. The color on the body softens and lightens under the neck and the underside of the cat and the insides of the legs. She has a wild look about her, but is not at all extreme, except in the color of the fur, which carries bands of color, giving her a richness and depth not seen in other breeds. This brings us to the end of our video. I hope you enjoyed it. Hit like if you did, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel so you don't miss any videos in the future. Also, watch the two videos that are on your screen right now, because I'm sure you'll love them. With that, I'll see you in the next video.